Welcome to our, our YouTube channel, Travel Addicts. Thanks for tuning in. I'd like to give a owner review uh, of the Bre Breville Barista Express. Uh, we've had this machine for a little over six months, and uh, nothing, absolutely nothing, has uh, messed up on the machine. It has worked perfect from the time we got it out of the box until now. It continues to make consistent espresso shots, consistent uh, espresso beverages, hot cold. Uh, we've done it all with this machine. And uh, the crema, I use uh, Lavazza Super Crema. We ordered it off Amazon. Uh, believe it or not, the crema sometimes in a cup that size can be half of the cup, sometimes more, three quarters. It's really, really nice. Really thick, rich crema. Um, it's got numerous adjustments. It is kind of considered a semi-automatic. Uh, uh, you do have the porta filter, the grind, the hopper, the adjustments for the amount and the grind size, and then the the wand for the milk frothing. Also for the storage, we have a little storage back here just to give you. A, indication on what all the machine has. Um, we make anywhere from four to ten shots of espresso today. We're probably teetering on needing a bigger machine, but you know I've looked at other machines and this one uh, does everything that we wanted to do consistently. It never misses a beat. Now I mess up frequently. This machine does not. You know I mess up on the temp size which might be you know, the Oracle has the self-tamping uh, part in the uh, the grinder, although uh, for, you know, $1,400 more to get self-tamping, it seems a bit extreme, because just for what this machine costs is a lot for us. It was a burden for us to buy this machine. Uh, and it is the only machine we use now. We had, uh, we've used uh, uh, numerous, this is our third espresso machine. Uh, we've thrown all them in the garden. Actually, tore up the other two. Uh, we we went to making uh, stove top Cuban style with the espresso maker, the double stack, uh, the little chrome and aluminum ones that you see. You know, 15 bucks, uh, and they did good. It doesn't make crema, not like this thing does. Um, I'm in love with this machine. If you can't tell, it's an awesome machine. I can't talk highly enough about it. Uh, we've even gotten rid of our coffee pot. We had a bun uh, coffee pot that we made coffee with every morning. We don't even use it anymore. We actually sold it, uh, passed along to somebody that might could use it. This is our primary coffee maker. Uh, we make uh, uh, Americanos in the morning. That's our black coffee. And then during the evening, a lot of times we'll make uh, you know another espresso beverage, uh, uh, be it a latte or cappuccino or or something I, you know, tinker around with, uh, and we, we, we've made uh, frappuccinos and uh, iced coffee. Uh, uh, you can do it all with this machine. There's no limitations. It just takes an imagination about what you want to make out of this machine because you will get consistent coffee, consistent espresso, consistent crema out of this machine every single time. If it's set up properly and you're using the same tamp, in the same grind size and the same amount each time it will produce the same shot every time so four and a half to five stars uh, 95 percent the only thing the biggest downfall is the size of the water tank could be bigger uh, I have to fill it every couple of days which is you know no big deal I can deal with that the other complaint would be the wand sometimes it has a couple of little grooves right here that the froth, the milk, will actually burn onto it, uh, and it can be a booger to get off. Um, I've taken toothpicks and knives and all kind of things to try to scratch it off, and of course, the the best way to do it is to get the wine warm again with some really hot water on your rag, and and, and get 99% off. Sometimes you have to come back and scratch a little bit of the the uh, froth off, which I'm not terribly fond of. Uh, but other than that, this machine, it doesn't miss a lick. Highly recommended. Can't talk good enough about it. Thanks for watching.